Good morning. Welcome back to CTV Morning Live. It is 6.30 a.m. And folks, the Senators will hit the ice for the first time today without Eric Carlson in the lineup. Yes, he's been traded and coming up in less than 15 minutes. We look at that trade that sent Carlson to San Jose and what it means for the club. Here's the latest with more on the trade. Trish. You were talking about how your toes feel a little tender after a morning <laughs> on points, especially if you're not really used to it. Uh, but they got me these little things called ouchies, and they actually make a really big difference. They line the tip mm. of your toe, mm. uh, so it's at least bearable. As we learned from Environment Canada in the last hour, the EF3, that's the class of tornado that made its way through Dunrobin, bringing wind speeds of up to 270 kilometers an hour with it. This is the first time that we have ever in Canadian history seen a tornado of that magnitude make its way through the region in the month of September. So quite frankly people are just gripping with what has become a reality ah! wow can i just admit that is the first time that i connected with the ball like that in at least 20 attempts well i'd like to introduce you to leon he is a king penguin here at the antarctica empire of the penguin exhibition i've got tears in my eyes there's something about the positive energy that you find only here at we day it's unlike anything else that we've seen and it's all thanks to these 16,000 people welcome back to ctv morning live it is 629 and the cleanup continues across eastern ontario and western quebec today following friday's serious storms coming up in less than 15 minutes here on ctv morning live we have the latest on recovery efforts and outline where you can drop off spoiled food you've only got until the end of the day to do it so don't miss that people have been reaching out to ask how they can help thousands, tens of thousands of sandbags were filled over the weekend, but at this point, because of all the fact that all power has been cut off here in Clarence Rockland, anyone who still is in their home and continuing to pump, all of that is being run by generators. So local residents have said if you are looking for a way to help, jerry cans, gas, these types of donation are really what's going to make the difference because they cannot continue to pump their homes without those generators running. And, and that's... Oh, oh sorry. sorry. <laughs> Pleasure to have you here today. Have fun on that stage. Okay, going to dance it out? Let's do it up. A reminder that We Day Ottawa is streaming live. You can catch oh. it all. We'll be right back here on CTV Morning Live. Woo!